God, oh God. Boy, boy. Hey, this is Phone Tech Kid, and today I'm going to be doing a review on AOKP 4.2.1 for your AT&T Galaxy S3. So as you can see, you have this awesome boot animation, which looks really, really nice. Um, so this is version, let's say, the date is 1.4, the release, and it is absolutely awesome. So as you can see, I have the widgets on the lock screen, and one of the features that only AOKP gets right now is to have any widgets on your lock screen. As you can see, I could have my email here, I have what's the song, and I have my XCA app. If I go to add widgets, I have all my widgets here. And there's no other ROM right now that does this. If I go in the, down into settings, in ROM control, and down to lock stream, if you go down to the bottom, it says allow all widgets, and and you could choose which widgets you want to allow. I don't know if you could read that. Yeah, allow and have unlimited widgets. So that's what I did, and then you could put whatever widgets you want there. So some of the settings that come in here, when you open this up, settings, you're going to have ROM control, OTA, themes, animation manager, and device options. So all your theming is going to be in ROM control. Starting off a general UI, you could customize your boot animation, change your carrier label, which is right here, down at the bottom. It says Phone Tech Kid. Um, you could vibrate on the expand for the notification, change the alpha on it, put your own customized background in the notification center. You could change the capacity of the status bar, which means you could make it transparent, which is pretty cool, but I'm not going to do that right now. You could enable kill all button, which is right here. You could kill all your apps. Uh, you could hold back to kill and some other settings right there. If you go into lock screen, as I showed you before, you have those settings. And you have volume music controls, so you can enable that, which is pretty cool. You also do get power menu, enable stuff there. Navigation bar, if you want what the Nexus has at the bottom. Customize your battery, clock, signal, your status bar toggles, which are the toggles, the new 4.2 toggles right here. Um, toggle per row, how much you want to have, and the order. Um, then you could customize your LED, play with the sound, what you want the sound to do, what you could do with it, um, and vibrations. So those are the stuff here, just to make sure that you know, here's Android 4.2.1. You could see AOKP version, sorry, AOKP version 4.2.1. So this is a really, really snappy ROM, and I'm absolutely in love with it. As you can see, I put the center clock there. Also, um, if you go into settings, I really suggest this, go down to developer options. Oops right here. Open that up and see where it says Windows Animation, Scale, all that stuff. Change those all to 0.5 and the animations will look a lot snappier and your phone will feel like a hundred times faster. So go try this ROM out. This is my favorite 4.2 ROM out right now. I really suggest trying it out and I hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe for more videos like this. ROM reviews, app reviews, other tech reviews, and make sure to check out my website at www.phonetechkid.com where I have a bunch of other stuff like top 5 ROMs, stuff like that. So just go check it out. I hope you enjoyed this video. God, oh God. Boy, boy. I've been working all